This will make your skin crawl. Peri Planta Americana, the American cockroach. These pests can be found in sewers, walls, beds, floors, cereals, and all sorts of nooks and crannies. And go and buy a video from electronic repair experts Tronix Fix. They also nest inside PlayStation 4s. According to Gizmodo, who spoke to several repairmen about the problem, it's more common than you'd expect. And before all you PS4 haters begin your trolling, it's worth mentioning cockroaches have been found in other consoles as well, okay? But the PS4 is apparently choice accommodation, as the vents are ideally located for the bugs to come and go as they please. The power supply is warm enough to keep the bugs feeling toasty. They do eventually get zapped by the inner workings of Sony's console, but then their corpses and poop melt into the hardware. Apparently, the roaches nest, grow up, poop, mate, have babies, which then themselves all grow up and mate and have babies and poop. And this insect orgy poop and death cycle goes on and on until your PS4 just can't take the horror anymore and taps out. What's worse is that Sony reportedly won't repair bug-ridden PS4s, but several independent repairmen like Tronix Fix will. Say no to safe spaces on YouTube. Support Tomo News at patreon.com slash Tomo News. Fun fact, cut off a cockroach's head and it will continue to live for a week. Ugh, nasty. More than one million cockroaches have escaped from a farm in Jiangsu, China, after an unknown suspect busted open the facility they were staying in. Wang Peng Sheng bred the cockroaches for use in traditional medicine, feeding them fruits and other foods. A section of the greenhouse they were bred in was busted open and the pests spilled out. Disease control are now investigating ways to stamp out the problem, but it doesn't look good for Mr. Peng Sheng, who claims he is in out thousands of dollars. He had expected to make around $160 for every kilogram of cockroaches he sold. Live cockroach removed from Chinese woman's ear. A woman in China received a doctor's diagnosis that will make your skin crawl. Video of the emergency procedure surfaced on December 6th and is making the entire internet squirm. The woman says one day she felt something fly into her ear. She could feel it buzzing around in there, but she just couldn't get to it. She says its wings were flapping and the pain and discomfort she was feeling became unbearable. When she went to the doctor's office, physicians used an endoscope to get a better look at the problem. Inside, they found a nasty intruder, making a commotion deep in the woman's eardrum. The doctors sprayed her ear with a chemical to calm the bug down. They used tweezers to get up in there and carefully yank the trespasser from her ear. It awoke a short time later, fully alive. Doctors believe the creepy crawler may have been attracted to the woman's warm ear as a result of food being left by the bed. Let that be a lesson to us all. No eating in bed. Everyone's worst nightmare. A woman in India got the shock of her life after discovering that the crawling sensation up her nose was in fact an actual creepy crawler. The 42-year-old domestic worker woke up to an itchy, tingling feeling in her nasal cavity that soon turned painful. Doctors suspected a nasal growth before deducing it was a foreign body moving around. To everyone's horror, the intruder turned out to be a fully grown live cockroach. The vile insect had crawled up the woman's nose while she was sleeping and lodged itself right between her eyes. It took nearly 45 minutes and a combination of methods before the live roach was finally pulled out of the woman's nose. Had it stayed in, doctors believe it would have died and given the unfortunate patient an infection. Ew. Guess we're all sleeping like this tonight.